Hi and welcome to my channel. This is Reviews with Ryan. Today I'm going to be reviewing a movie called Land. This movie was directed by Robin Wright, has a runtime of 89 minutes, and has made $1.1 million at the box office so far. This movie just came out last week, February 12th, in theaters. It stars Robin Wright, uh, also directing it, Kim Dickens, and Damien Bashir. The movie is about a local hunter rescuing a grieving lawyer after her family has passed away and she has decided to retreat into the wilderness of the Rockies. Uh, this is actually filmed in Alberta, Canada. The cinematography in this movie is so good. I honestly cannot rave so much about this, uh, this cinematography in this. It's, it's so great in this movie. Uh, I like that, you know, we have a woman here that has never been in the wilderness by herself. She's starting a new life. And the character that she meets in this, uh, played by Damien Bashir, he pretty much is kind of in the uh, same boat as far as his past history with his family. And he pretty much is teaching her the ways to survive in this wilderness. And really, they're the two main characters in the movie. It's a short runtime. So uh, in the first like 20, 25 minutes, there's not a lot of dialogue. Uh, which is kind of cool, though, because it kind of sets up everything in the story. Uh, there's no wasted time in this movie. It gets right into the story. It cuts to the chase. But once it gets into kind of the story, you know, you find what the character, what both characters, you know, what their background is. And, you know, they kind of get to know each other as the film progresses. And honestly, like watching this movie, I don't think I could ever actually live in the wilderness, you know, out in the middle of nowhere like that. I think it'd be very difficult for me. And, um, you know, the, the house that she's living in is kind of old. It's kind of like a little, you know, wooden shack kind of to speak, you know, and there's a little outhouse for the bathroom, which is, you know, something different to kind of see there. And, uh, you know, the, the snow and, and up in the mountains, it just, it makes it really pop on the screen. You know, the colors are, are really great on the screen. Uh, the, you know, it really made you feel like you're there. You know, there's a, a river that runs down there where you can go fishing and stuff. I thought that was really cool. So I can't rave, I can not talk about so much the cinematography so much in this movie. It was just really darn good. So if you don't like this movie at all, I would be surprised anybody saying that the cinematography is bad in this because it's just, I think it's great. But with that in mind, the movie is, like I said, it's 89 minutes and, you know, it cuts to the chase and it's, it's a pretty good movie. Uh, I like that the different messages they have in the movie, they do a good job of uh, kind of making you feel sorry for the characters and, and feel their pain and a lot of other people, you know, if they've experienced, you know, death in their families, uh, there will be a lot of relatability to this film. And, you know, I felt the re relatability to those characters as well. Uh, so they do a good job with that. There's a good message. The ending is kind of a little bit of abrupt, I would say, but the film is pretty solid and I think that everybody should check it out. I'm going to rate it a three and a half out of five stars. Uh, like I said, this is a pretty solid movie. I think everybody should check it out. It has a pretty decent story and I think everybody will enjoy it. But with that said, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think and thank you guys for checking this out.